Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the International Excellence in Masonry Awards. Education K through 8, and the nominees are Wanky Pru Road Elementary, Contractor Brazos Masonry Incorporated, Architect Noonan Dockery Riddiman Architects. San Alejo Elementary Schools, Contractor, New Dimension Masonry Incorporated, Architects, HMC Architects. And the winner is San Alejo Elementary School. The jury found the playful use of a variety of masonry systems within this campus to be very fitting for an elementary school. The various colors and textures seem to produce an environment conductive to creativity and learning. The project attempts to intelligently deploy the inherent thermal properties of masonry on a relatively large scale in order to maximize the building's thermal mass within this hot climate and contribute to the overall goals of the LEED program. While more attention could have been paid to the detailing of the transitions from one masonry system to another, the overall design intent was commendable. Education 9 through 12. And the nominees are Mainland High School Replacement Project, Contractor, Beeler Barney and Associations, Masonry Contractors Incorporated, Architect, Reynolds Smith and Hills Incorporated. Valley Center Maxine Theater, Contractor, New Dimension Masonry Incorporated, Architect, Davy Architecture. And the winner is Valley Center Maxine Theater. This project demonstrates careful handling of a problematic sloping site. The decision to insert the building into the hill provides an overall massing that does not impose on the site and complements the sloping seat bank requirements in the theater. The architects are complemented on their coordination of contrasting bands of smooth and split face masonry units. These bands were carefully integrated with door and window headers, window mullions, and shading devices to form strong horizontal lines that break up the large expanses of blank walls, which are unavoidable in a theater. The flaring concrete entry piece is a strong contrast to the planar masonry walls. The masonry contract obviously took considerable time to detail and complete the installation. The construction joints are appropriately placed and the block walls appear to have been constructed with very few cut units. Education, College and University and the nominees are Montgomery College, Student Services Center, Contractor, Genco Masonry, Architect, Einhorn Yaffe Prescott. Joe Rosenfield, 25 Center, Contractor, Forest and Associate Incorporated, Architect, Pelly Clark, Pelly Architects. Clark College, Penguin Student Union, Building Expansion and Renovation, Contractor, B&B Tile and Masonry Corp., Architect, Opsis Architecture. Central Washington University, Wenatachi Higher Education Center. Contractor, Sterling Construction Company, Incorporated. Architect, Integris Architecture. University of Dayton, Fitness and Recreation Complex. Contractor, Lang Masonry Contractors, Incorporated. Architect, Hastings and Chevetta Architects. Babson College Residence Hall, Contractor, Erlin Construction, Architect, Perkins and Will.
Wentworth Institute of Technology Residence Hall. Contractor, Bond Brothers. Architect, Perkins and Will. Our Lady of Perpetual Help, Campus Chapel at Walsh University. Contractor, Oliveri Construction. Architect, Peninsula Architects. And the winner is Joe Rosenfield 25 Center. This project exhibits a skillful solution to a very difficult architectural problem. Making a very large building look and feel like a composition of smaller buildings. The architects achieve this through the use of several different kinds of masonry, all of which complement each other without compromising the overall clarity of the building's design. The execution of the masonry detailing supports the architectural intent in a constant way throughout. There is a long, taut red brick facade with a stepping ribbon window, a crisp cubic block clad in limestone with punched openings, a hovering corner block of slate that floats over a glazed void, and a drum cylinder of red porphyry that appears monolithic. It is in fact hollowed out that anchors the buildings to its site. The jury admired the ability of the architects and builders to realize a level of detailing and construction that could accommodate the complexities of the design. Masonry is exhibited here as a contemporary building material. However, the nuances of the various individual forms, use of masonry alludes to the evolution of the material from load-bearing and monolithic toward high-performing environmental envelope. Government Institutional and the nominees are Frisco City Hall and Library Contractor Lee Lewis Construction Incorporated Architect Bolzman Moss Architecture LLP Cherokee Health Systems Contractor Wasco Incorporated Architect Cockrell Design and Planning A new church at Holy Innocence Parish. Contractor, Wards Masonry. Architect, Becker Architects. Peace Palace of the Woodlands. Contractor, Lucia Group Incorporated. Architect, Truett Architectural Services. National City Fire Station 34 Contractor New Dimension Masonry Incorporated Architect Jeff Katz Architecture And the winner is Holy Innocence Parish The jury felt that Holy Innocence Parish building was equally beautiful in form and execution. The strong slipping planes defined by the masonry walls not only frame the front and rear elevations of the building, but also provide stiffening pilasters for the tall masonry walls. The interior of the building shows a careful consideration of complementary materials. In this case, split face block with glued laminated timber beams. The horizontal banding, vertical pilasters, and careful insertion of window slits help reduce the scale of this otherwise very large building. The interior has drama achieved by Manios of Our Lady of Angels without the confusing exterior elevations. The details imagined confirm that the contractors were careful in their detailing and execution of the project. Industrial Commercial and the nominees are Flower Corporate Headquarters Contractor, Clayco Incorporated. Architect, Form Studio. 